going to share with you the best process for installing the absolute lightest AMD drivers on your Lenovo Legion Go or any other Z1 Extreme handheld. This will ensure you can play the lightest games with full compatibility and support along with access to AMD Adrenaline, AFMF2, Anti-Lag, Radeon Chill and much more. I'll be guiding you step by step on how to safely uninstall your previous drivers and install the new ones as quickly as possible. Open your web browser in Windows and from the link in the description we need to access AMD's drivers page. Here we're going to scroll down and select processors, Ryzen, Ryzen 7000 series and scroll down to and select AMD Ryzen 7 7840U and press submit. On the next page we want to select download for AMD software adrenaline edition which will be in between 700 to 800 megabytes in size. Download this to your downloads folder and next we want to obtain display driver uninstaller or DDU for short from the link in the description. We're going to scroll down and choose one of the two mirrors available and download this to our downloads folder. Once both files are downloaded let's extract DDU by going inside and choosing extract all followed by extract. Afterwards we want to hold press on the Windows start menu and choose settings. In here select system scroll down to recovery and in advanced startup we're going to select restart now and restart now again for our Legion Go to boot into recovery mode where we'll need to turn our device portrait. From the choices available we need to select troubleshoot, advanced options, startup settings and press restart. Let's turn our Legion Go back to landscape and tap on the screen to reveal a keyboard which we want to tap to select the number 4 which is going to restart the Legion Go again and boot us into safe mode. Once we're logged in and on the desktop let's access our downloads folder from this PC and downloads. Let's go inside our DDU folder that we extracted earlier. Double click on the DDU zip, press run, select extract, enter the folder that appears and run display driver uninstaller. When DDU loads press OK on the prompt that appears and from the bottom of the choices available under advanced options we need to select prevent downloads of drivers from Windows update. Press OK on the prompt and then press X to close. On the main DDU screen we're going to go ahead and choose device type and select GPU and from here we're going to simply select the top left choice clean and restart highly recommended. Now DDU is going to perform a full and thorough uninstall of our old GPU drivers. This can take up to 5 minutes and once complete the Legion Go will restart leaving safe mode and returning to our normal Windows system. Once loaded our desktop may be portrait so hold press on the desktop, select display settings and for display orientation let's select landscape flipped from the choices available and keep changes. Once we're back in landscape hold press on the start menu, choose settings and windows update. In here if the choice is available under pause updates we need to select pause for 5 weeks and close the window. Go to this PC and your C drive and if you have an AMD folder present hold press and delete this folder pressing continue to confirm. Once that's done go to your downloads folder and double click on the latest AMD driver setup we obtained earlier. The installation will begin and we will be provided an error message which we're going to simply drag the window until we can see the red button for exit in the bottom right and select this to close the window. Go back to this PC and your C drive to see that a new AMD folder has now appeared. Hold press on the start menu again and this time we want to select device manager to see our system hardware components. Let's go to display adapters and hold press on Microsoft Basic Display Adapter, choosing Update Driver from the list. Once the window opens, we're going to select Browse My Computer for Drivers. Let me pick from a list of available drivers 
and Have Disk. In this new window, we're going to choose Browse. From here, we're going to choose this PC, our C drive, AMD, AMD software installer, packages, drivers, display, WT6A INF, and inside this folder, we're going to choose the only numbered file ending in .inf from the list and press open. Press OK and from the list of AMD models that appear, we're going to go through this list and identify AMD Radeon TM 780M graphics specifically. Choose this model and press next. On the warning screen, go ahead and press yes. Here, we'll be waiting a few minutes for the installation of our drivers to complete. And once our screen flashes off and back on again, we want to press close on the prompt that appears. And we can confirm that our Microsoft Basic Display Adapter is now AMD Radeon Graphics. Now, we need to go to this PC and our C drive, go inside the AMD folder, AMD Software Installer, Packages, Drivers, Display, WT6A INF, but this time we need to enter this numbered folder which contains over a hundred files and we want to scroll down and find a file called CC2 install and double click this file. This file will automatically begin the installation of AMD Adrenaline to pair with our new and latest AMD GPU driver. After a few minutes press close, close the window and access your start menu where we should see AMD settings now available. Run AMD settings for the first time. Choose skip this from the bottom and we can confirm in the top right hand corner our current version and when the driver was released. Now briefly let's select the gaming tab and choose graphics to show all of our AMD adrenaline features and options that we can toggle on when we want to use them such as AMD Fluid Motion Frames 2, Radeon Antilag, Radeon Boost, Radeon Chill, as well as many more options to use in our games. For now, restart your Legion Go if you haven't already, and fire up one of your new favourite games, and enjoy the latest and always up to date experience for your hardware from AMD directly. If a new driver comes out from AMD in a few weeks, check their release notes for fixes and support with new games, and simply perform all the steps that I've shown you in this guide again. Now I hope this guide helps you all with installing the latest drivers for your Lenovo Legion Go or other Z1 Extreme handhelds and if you have any questions please drop a comment below and I'll try my best to answer you. And if you enjoyed this guide and learnt something new today please give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, comment below and share this guide with others. You all have a wonderful day, take care of one another and I'll see you later.